Probably the key aspects of our machines that concern ordinary people. Lumberjacks, factory workers, builders, they are less concerned with the intricacies of the workings of the network. But this is precisely what our team had in mind when we were designing and developing PTA-4, which stands for Polymer Technology Alloy Algorithm 4 in both its military and civilian applications. It is a joint product of multiple research and development complexes of Facility 3826. It's something that I and Comrade Shalomi oversaw personally. Unfortunately, I must inform you that the resulting alloy demonstrated such phenomenal properties that it was declared top secret. Just like PTA-3 before it. Therefore, I can only brag to you about our achievements and leave its composition and structure as an intellectual exercise, a kind of homework assignment. Wear resistance and safety. Probably, Probably the key aspects of machines that consume. An extra minute spent at last 50 minutes dollars under control. <laughs> There's no other way forward. The Babylon complex is one of the facility's largest subdivisions. It can There's no other way forward. We have to take it. Take it where? Petrov escaped while working in Babylon's cold workshop. It would be logical to begin our search there. So, how do I get there? First, we need to get to the distribution center. This cable car will take us there. For both passengers and freight. The network can be used to reach any point in our vast territory within minutes without wasting precious work hours. swim through polymer. I've done it before. It's nice, actually. Kind of like swimming with whales and dolphins in the ocean. It's so peaceful.
Reboot the control system to reactivate the line. How am I supposed to restart the line? There should be a control panel nearby. <laughs> you don't say. There's the control panel. And of course it's locked. You guys just love these things, don't you? This is a new one. A combination lock. Ugh. It'd take me a year to guess the combo. Look around. Maybe someone has the code. Station Master. What a joke. Uh, what was that? Comrades. They won't go without a schematic. We're now all stuck. No schematic. No go. Fuck me, he's alive. Schematic. Need a schematic. Unfortunately, he's dead. We are surrounded by corpses. Why have you frozen just like everything here? They won't go. Nope, won't go without the schematic. The dead have a residual neural polymer memory and are capable of communicating for some time after death. Well, shit. Okay, so where's this diagram of yours? Schematic. The schematic, the one I need to move the cars. Where is it? The station monster has it. He didn't make it. Wasn't as fast as me. He died. Everybody here is as dead as fuck. Did the station master die in this tunnel? This tunnel. He died. And everything froze. Right in front of my eyes. You need the schematic. One day and the next, enjoy a beautiful mountain vista. And Are you sure the station master has it? Does he take it with him everywhere he goes? He carries it with him. The station master. Find him. Find him. Get the schematic. Got it. I'll look for it. Maybe I should have said thank you. Holy shit, a talking corpse. What did you say, comrade major? You know, I fought in the whole war from beginning to end. I've seen some shit. But talking corpses, that's a new one. How the fuck is this even possible? It's a byproduct of lingering neuropolymer memory activity. Everyone killed here was polymerized. Their brains haven't decomposed yet, so they remain connected with the neuropolymer. Station. There get it is. the cable cars online and get out of here! Charles, so this isn't a dead person talking to me. It's the neuropolymer in his noggin, right? Crudely speaking, yes. As it fades away, neuropolymer memory temporarily stores the individual's last thoughts. Creepy. How long are they gonna talk for? I can't say exactly. Somewhere between a minute and a couple of days. But it seems the more time passes after death, the more corrupt the information becomes. I see. So the stuff they're saying isn't always that important. Poor bastards. This works. The cable car line is activated. Welcome, passengers. Please take your seats. Send them no out. Ticket. Speed them up. Sorry, no ticket. Access granted.
We are ready to depart. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six. Off we go. Ugh, this tunnel's messed up. It's gonna be a bumpy ride. We need to find a way to move forward. But frankly, I'm having trouble figuring out how. Climbing the wall. That's how. Do you have mountaineering training? I'm a spec ops soldier. Not some city wuss riding a desk. I've got all kinds of training. I must admit, I'm quite glad to hear that. Lexus Major. You bet. I wouldn't survive without him. can drill through even the hardest minerals at incredible speed. Soviet science has high hopes for them in regard to our inevitable conquest of all the planets in the solar system.
such good care of those wonderful, powerful, brilliantly designed machines. And now, oh, the irony. What are you talking about? The Burovs, our finest product. What a shame. Did you know we weren't allowed to sell them abroad, Comrade? What's so ironic about that? Oh, it's ridiculous, really. I was a roboticist here, you see. I was a Borov roboticist. When I heard the robots were attacking people, I rushed here. Wanted to switch mine off. So they chopped me up. I was killed by my own machines. The control panels got buried under the rubble. Now they're on their own, digging God knows what. Like they're sleepwalking or something. I wonder what they're dreaming of without us. Why is there a ban on exporting them? They're cutting edge city building machinery, that's why. Point them at the ground and in a month you'll have a complete subway system or any sort of tunnel. Subway is hell. It's the moon they were going to use them for. So their top secret in their armor is tougher than a tank's. PTA plates unmarked. Cutting edge sides. You worked on the Burovs? From day one. Built just about everything in here. Used to be no artificial sea, no fields, no forests or anything here. To say nothing of the cable cars. Just mountain ranges. No hardly. Anyone stops to think about what it used to be like here. And it's all thanks to my Borovs. We moved mountains, built the whole infrastructure. They're tearing down what they built. They've got no idea. A machine's mind is like a small child's, you know. It needs love and care, or it'll descend into confusion. Man, do I ever love crawling through dark-ass tunnels. That was a fucking hell of a ride. Under ordinary circumstances, the cable car network links all the underground sectors of Facility 3826. It should be easier next time. Thanks, bud. I think I'll just hoof it on the surface. Stop. What a nice trip. Data. Oh, a laser wall. That's some serious security. People put them up for a reason. If you see one, that means there's something important on the other side. Quite right, Comrade Major. The distribution center we're looking for is, in fact, on the other side. There's no way I'm making it through a laser wall in one piece. There's a repair vendor up ahead. 
Try upgrading your equipment to increase your laser resistance. Not a pervy lunatic fridge. over to third parties constitutes a crime against the party and is punishable by law. Honey, you're back! What took you so long? I was so lonely. Uh-huh. Look, I need to go through a laser wall. Preferably alive. What a silly idea, honey. That's awful risky. You should stay with me instead. I'll do whatever you want. Ugh, just give me laser protection. Oh, so brutal. I'm shaking. Squirt your polymer inside me. Don't let her boss you around. We have no time to waste. Don't listen to him, big guy. He wants to drive us apart. Take off that stupid glove so we can stay together forever. I see. Do you want me to punch you? or tear you apart. You'd really kill me over a stupid glove, sugar? How would you survive in this cruel, violent world without me? Easily. It's not like you're actually helping me or anything. But I can't make things for you out of thin air, sugar. I need polymer and other components to work. Put your polymer inside me so I can pleasure you. All right, I get it. You'll get your polymer and your precious components. Just install the laser protection already. Whatever you say, stud. Upgrade initiated. Relax and enjoy. Just promise you'll talk dirty to me again. I am so gonna punch you. Yes, yes! Punish me, master! I love dominant males. Oh, gross. Your defense system is active. Try to run through the laser wall. <laughs> After that creepy shit, I'd be willing to run through any wall. 